It's amazing that the whole crypto industry is now waking up to what I've been talking about since 2022, which is that the community is the asset, not the code, which also translates to cults, neo-religions, community coins, them forming powerful bases. And what's actually more fascinating is you have all these Soilana coins, which it's great. There's, there's meme coins and stuff and altcoin communities popping up out here. But the neo-religion that everyone's looking for, it's Pulse Chain. Do we have tattoos? Yes. Multiple hex tattoos. Multiple Pulse Chain tattoos. Do we have conferences? Two of them every year. Two. We had conferences when the coin's still down 99%. 99% down. Maddie Allen still had the conferences. PulseX down 93% from the sacrifice price. Your ICO price down 93%. Guess what? Still a conference. Hex conference and a separate Pulse Chain conference. You got 15 year stakers. You got people who will lock up their money 5, 10, 15 years in Hex. You have all of these. You have an army of people promoting Richard Hart videos chopped up, clipped, and put on TikTok, Instagram. We've got the van. Literally, remember the Pulse Chain van? I got candy. Get in the van. It's got the logos everywhere. 170 content creators. None of them paid. None of us are getting paid. It's the opposite of payment, bro. You're paying with your blood like everybody else. It's all these other influencers promoting like Pui and all these other things. They're getting paid. In Pulse Chain community, no one got paid at all. In fact, they have to sacrifice. They are negative on the payment. They have like paid with their blood to be able to promote. <laughs> you can't go deeper than that. You just can't. They, they paid with the sacrifice and they still said nice things. They still believed. They can't, they can't beat it. How can you beat that? Where's your trial by fire, huh? Where's your down 99% badge? You don't get it. I want to see you survive that. They don't get it. If you are a altcoin on Pulse Chain, that is holding down the fort around you. You got an army of believers. It's everywhere, man. It's like all around. It, the whole chain is just filled with believers. The cabal isn't in. They don't even know how to bridge in. They don't even know. So Pulse Chain really is Blue Ocean, but it won't be Blue Ocean forever. You get it? It won't be Blue Ocean forever. Maybe at Cardanzo's level, it's going to start to be half and half. And that's about 20 billion market cap-ish, probably probably around 15. So it's, it's Pulse, it's around 10 to 15x bigger from today. That means everything 10 to 15x bigger. All your altcoins 10 to 15x bigger. That's combined hex, that's like 20 cents, etc. Now you're having half and half. You get to Soilana size, there's cabal people everywhere, forget it. But what I mean by cabal people everywhere, you're going to have your high value stuff. It's just for new people coming in, um, they have to join the biggest leagues. And by joining the biggest leagues, that's completely fine. You just get lower return. But that's, that's the price you pay, right? You, you get your lower return because you're taking less risk. We're taking all the risk so we get the higher reward. That's just it. That's markets. If you want to take low risk and get low return, go buy Bitcoin. You want less risk than that? Go buy a government bond. You see? So it depends where you want to be on the risk curve. The value here is just too big. I don't care what, I don't care what they say. Oh, wow. There's cults and communities everywhere. Friends, by the end of this bull market, you're going to be sick of the word cult. Okay? You're going to be sick of it. When I started saying it, it was controversial. It was like, ooh, taboo. We're going to be sick of this word cult by the end because everyone's going to say, I'm a cult now. Yes, I am a cult member. But you'll know. You'll know. And luckily for you and me, we're in an industry where you can speculate on people coming in after you. You're basically, it's amazing. Everybody's taking their bets on their own megaphone. And you're betting that your megaphone is going to bring people in. But, you know, it's not a crude way to look at the world. That's what cities are. Have you ever heard of New York? Have you ever heard of America? If you are long the S&P 500, you are long 
America's number go up. You are long America producing more people, so immigrating more people or having more babies, number one. And then the second component of that, you're, um, you're betting on companies making more products and selling to the people. It's number go up. It's the exact same thing in crypto. The exact same thing. We have people coming in and then we have people like enhancing their products, their community feeling and their religion and their cult stuff. It's the same thing. It's literally the same thing. You're betting on number go up. It's just that we've been indoctrinated to think stock market is the be all and end all, but it's not. That's because it's, you know, because we don't blame them. That's new technology, man. Radio was considered some sort of foreign concept. And it was some like amazing groundbreaking technology that could bring in bring about uh, devil and Satan at the start. And I'm I'm being serious about that. That's what they thought about radio at the start. Now look at it. You're like radio. That's for boomers. Yeah, <laughs> I'm telling you now. Stonks are for boomers, man. Stonks are for boomers. Can you provide liquidity and farm between Tesla and the S and P 500? No, you can't. You can't do that. SPI or the index. You can't do that, right? All these new concepts, they're all here in crypto. And we, we, we know we're a better system. And we know Pulse Chain's a near religion. We know it is. It's just a matter of time. They're going to keep coming, friends. Now, obviously, the, what everyone argues about, it's, it's funny. We, we all know what's happening. It's just now we argue, oh, are we only going to grow our user base from about, I think there's about maybe 200,000 unique individuals, 250,000 unique wallets. Okay. Are we going to grow that like, the user base, 3x, a 5x, a 10x, or 100x. And by the way, if you want the price multiple of that, you square each number. So the user base is going to go up by 3. The price will be 9x higher for the whole ecosystem. If you believe the user base will go up by 10, you're saying 100x. Or even higher. That's what everyone's arguing about. Like, you know, where, where, where else are we going from here? Oh, markets go down. We already saw nine minus 99%. So the future is looking bright, my friends.